the science of Matariki. Every winter, New Zealanders are treated to a beautiful display of bright blue stars which rise over the horizon before dawn. Scientists call them Pleiades, or the Seven Sisters. Māori call them Matariki. There's more than a thousand of them, but most people can only see seven. They're about 4,000 trillion kilometres away, but despite this, are amongst the closest group of stars to Earth. They formed from a cloud of gas and dust about 100 million years ago. Galileo was the first person to observe them with a telescope, and he saw many more than seven. Cultures from all over the world have been seeing them for centuries, and most have their own stories about them, including Māori, who say the stars belong to the god of the wind, who tore his eyes out when he became angry that the Sky Father and the Earth Mother were separated from their offspring. Before Europeans settled, the appearance of Matariki before dawn marked the beginning of the Māori New Year, and that's what most people think of when they hear the phrase. Because Matariki was always in winter, it was a time to rest, learn and plan for the year ahead after harvesting crops all summer. If the stars were bright and clear, then the next year's crop would be bountiful. Each star also represents a particular element. Tupuanuku, lots of food. Tupuarangi, lots of birds. Waipunarangi, how relationships will fare. Waiti, food from freshwater. Waipa, food from the sea. Ururangi, the weather. And Matariki was the leader. If you want to see Pleiades or Matariki, look to the left of where the sun is about to rise. The best time to see them at this time of year is about 6.30 in the morning.